Hey, today I'm going to be showing you some easy stretches to get your splits. These are the stretches that I did when I first started trying to get flexible and things like that that helped me get to my splits. Also, I'll be showing you the correct like positions to do your splits. Now first you need to figure out what kind of splits you want to get, right or left. Whatever way you choose or whatever way you feel comfortable is the way you will do all these stretches. I think you should do the stretches on each side just to make sure you're equally flexible with each leg, which is what I did, but it's up to you. Now I'm going to start by grabbing my leg and pulling it close to my chest bent, as you can see as I'm doing here. And this is with whatever leg you want or whatever leg you want to get your splits with. Hold this for about 10 seconds. Now I'm going to go and square my hips towards whatever way I'm doing my splits and try my best to get my nose to my knee, which is very important. You want to keep your back straight along with your back leg and your front leg. Everything should be straight. Hold this for 15 seconds, then we're going to move to the middle and reach under you. And you want to square your hips towards the middle and you just want to use the floor to kind of pull your body underneath your legs which will help you with a deeper stretch hold this for 15 seconds now we're going to go into a lunge you want to drop your knee to the floor and square your hips towards whatever way you are lunging or doing your split you can lift your knee up if you want a deeper stretch but if you're looking for the easier way just drop your knee to make it easier you want to hold this for about 10 to 15 seconds Coming up from that lunge, we're going to go to a backwards lunge where you basically just want to straighten your front leg and bend your back leg. Make sure your nose is touching your knee, which is very important, or not touching your knee, but trying to keep it as close as possible. Next, you want to sit back on that back leg and do the same thing and try to get your knee as close to your nose as possible. Now we're going to go into a straddle, which isn't a split. Just keep in mind that. And it doesn't matter how far apart your legs are, it can be an inch apart or it can be super far apart. It's totally up to how flexible you are. So you want to reach over, but you want to stay to the side, keeping your opposite hip from the one that you're stretching from on the ground is very important. After holding that for about 15 seconds, you want to turn and face forward towards your leg and keep your nose towards your knee just like all the other stretches, along with keeping that hip on the floor. Now I'm just gonna reach towards the middle, keeping my hips square to the middle, and just sit there for 15 seconds. Now I'm gonna turn over and lay flat on my back, and I wanna keep my bottom leg straight as I'm bringing my top leg, which is whatever leg it will be in the front of you during your splits, and pull my knee as close to my chest as possible. Holding this for 15 seconds. Now I'm going to take that same leg and extend it outward, keeping it straight along with my bottom leg, along with my back, which should be all should be straight. Hold this for 15 seconds. I'm now going to go on my knees and take whatever leg I want to be in the front of my split onto the front of me. And I'm going to slowly slide down as far as I can, keeping my hips squared towards the front, which is very, very important. Having it to the side can result in entry. And you want to slide down as if you can and just continue doing this and hold it for about 30 seconds or as long as you can. Now, how I'm doing it right here is not okay and it's not good. You do not want to have your leg bent. It could result in serious injury. So you want to keep your hips squared towards the front, and yeah. Okay, I hope you enjoyed the video. Remember that you have to do these stretches every single day to see results, and doing them twice a day will help you get results faster. Me personally, I did this like all day because when I first started getting my splits, it was during the summertime, so I would just sit in front of the TV and stretch, and there's a, multiple other stretches that you can do to help you get your splits, but the more you stretch, the more you'll get your splits. These are just a few easy stretches that will help you get to them. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video. Bye!